I have a rather ambivalent relationship with authority figures. I've already talked about my mother in other videos, and for those who haven't watched those, suffice it to say, she was abusive, but there was still love between us, and she was rather authoritarian. But there are other authority figures who have impacted my life greatly. In kindergarten, the teacher had this approach where she would say she would not listen to anybody saying something negative. What she would do was draw an ear at the center of the blackboard. And if anybody had something negative to say, you had to go and whisper it into the ear. And this was, of course, rather embarrassing and she did it not only to not have to hear these negative things, she did it to kind of shame us out of saying negative things, period. And this was one of the earliest times I realized that I couldn't trust authority figures, that they wouldn't actually uphold the rules. I was always very eager to live up to their expectations, to try to live up to their rules. And I had, of course, been told that, you know, when somebody, you know, you always have to tell the truth and all that other, you know, complete BS that doesn't work in real life. And it caused an early cognitive dissonance. I know why she did it. I know that she had worked as a kindergarten teacher for many years and she was fed up. And I can't personally imagine dealing with new kids over and over because I know kids can be just awful. But when you're in that situation, resign or get some other area. Don't work with children if you genuinely want as little contact with them as you can. And if there isn't some good opportunity for someone like that, because it's not like she just, you know, she was willing to work. She just wasn't willing to listen to us. So she could have gotten another job. And if there isn't, then, you know, we need to work towards that. To have jobs for teachers who are just fed up. Because it happens, of course. They're only human. You know, how much can you take? But they shouldn't stay in those jobs, is all I'm saying. 